Learn how to install Docker Desktop with ease on your Windows 11 computer using the latest method available. Let's head over to any web browser and type and search for Docker Doc. On the search results, click on this very first link, which starts with Docs. On the official page, click on Get Docker. And it's available for Mac, Windows, and even Linux operating systems. Let's download for Windows. Also, I would suggest that you download from this website, and not from Microsoft Store, as Microsoft Store may have restrictions, that could interfere with the workflow. So click on this blue button as shown, to download the exe file. The file is of around 600 megabytes approximately. And meanwhile it's downloading, let's check its requirements. The first requirement is to have WSL installed in your system. To check, simply hold the window logo key and the letter R. On the run prompt, type CMD, and press enter, to open the command box. Simply type WSL, and hit enter. As you can see, I do not have WSL, installed. So to install it, simply type the command as shown here, and hit enter. The installation process should start immediately. But if it does not start, you can install it manually, and I have made a dedicated video on the same, link will be in description for your reference. As you can see Windows subsystem for Linux is getting installed into the computer. Once the installation process is over, it's mandatory to restart the computer, to apply the changes. Once it boots up, let's enable Linux. And to do so, search and open turn Windows feature on or off. Here you can enable and disable Windows feature with just a click. Here search for Windows subsystem for Linux, and turn it on, by checking the box, before its name. After this process, do not restart the device now, as we will do it later on. Now, hold the window logo key, and the letter R. On the run dialog box, type, Winver, which stands for Windows version, and hit enter. The reason for checking the Windows version, is because, it's one of the requirement for running Docker. And the final requirement is to have hardware virtualization enabled. To check, simply search for Task Manager, and navigate to the Performance section. As you can see, virtualization is enabled, but if it's not, you must enable it from the BIOS. Now let's go ahead and install Docker. Head over to the File Manager, and locate the Docker .exe file which we downloaded earlier. Double-click on the file, to install the same. And next, click on OK. The installation process will start, and it may take a while to install the same. So meanwhile, you can hit like, and subscribe to my channel. Once the installation is complete, click on close and log out and restart your computer. Once the device boots up, search for Docker, and simply launch the tool. Agree to the terms and condition. You can decide to log in, but for now let's skip this login process. As you can say, the Docker is successfully installed in my Windows 11 computer. You can also verify it, by opening the command box, and typing WSL, space, hyphen, letter L, space, hyphen, letter V, and hit enter. You can see, it displays its status, and also its version number. Now if you want to run Android app, in your Windows computer, watch my next video.